हेलो ऑल ऑफ यू आई एम डॉक्टर तुषार राउत आई एम अ कंसल्टेंट न्यूरोलॉजिस्ट एंड अ स्ट्रोक स्पेशलिस्ट एट कोकिला बेन धीरूभाई अंबानी हॉस्पिटल सो वी हैव गैदर्ड हियर टुगेदर टू अंडरस्टैंड समथिंग मोर अबाउट स्ट्रोक सो आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट बेसिकली व्हाट इज स्ट्रोक यू नो सो वी शुड नो व्हाट आर द सिम्टम्स ऑफ स्ट्रोक साइंस एंड सिम्टम्स सो दैट वी पिकअप एट द अर्लीएस्ट व्हाट आर द ट्रीटमेंट मोडालिटीज फॉर स्ट्रोक हाउ टू ट्रीट स्ट्रोक एंड प्रिवेंट योर फ्रॉम हैविंग अ डिसेबिलिटी or 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 a deficit wherein you cannot live a normal life and how to prevent stroke as well in terms of uh, once you have a stroke or if you are at risk of getting a stroke so what are the conditions wherein we should be watchful for so as to address them before before getting uh, a massive stroke now what is stroke uh, it is an abrupt onset of neurological deficit like there is one sided weakness either the right or the left side of the body facial weakness arm weakness slurring of speech or you become drowsy or your level of consciousness drops down so any of these symptoms which occur suddenly that suggest that you are getting a stroke and if any of these symptoms if you come across as a family member in any of your family members if you see or or surroundings in the society you are you are traveling and you find someone getting these symptoms the first thing is that it needs to be done is the patient should be referred to a stroke ready hospital wherein all the all the facilities are available so as to do an urgent scan and start the subsequent treatment now uh, the fast slogan uh, we all know that there is facial weakness arm weakness slurring so any of the symptoms if you see in your clinic or or bedside or in the society or at home so you should refer the patient to the stroke ready hospital the reason is we should not lose the golden hour now what is a golden hour any patient who gets a stroke the fast the faster the treatment the faster and the better the recovery because every minute wasted means you are losing about a billion neurons for every minute of uh, time that is wasted when you get a stroke hence uh, there is a special thrombolytic or a clot busting medication which is available in the first 4 and a half hours after stroke so if a patient get, is eligible for that we do a ct scan or an mri scan quickly and we rule out a bleed basically there are two types of stroke one is an ischemic stroke where there is a blockage in the artery and other is a hemorrhagic stroke where the artery ruptures or bursts because of high blood pressure so if there is a hemorrhagic stroke then we cannot give that injection then we just have to control the blood pressure and give medicines to reduce the brain swelling if there is an ischemic stroke then definitely this treatment is effective wherein we give this clot busting medication to open the vessel now if the patient improves with this medication well and good but if he doesn't improve god forbid for some reason then we have other treatments also available like interventional treatment or endovascular treatment where in, where just like a heart attack we can do an angioplasty there or we can open the artery by taking out sucking out the clot or the thrombus and uh, restoring the blood supply so once the blood supply is restored the cells do no more die further and the recovery starts faster recovery can happen immediately as well as up to 3 months and the person can lead a as good as normal life after the stroke now what are the precautions that needs to be taken once a patient gets a stroke he should be regular with his lifestyle he should do regular physiotherapy he should uh, take the medications that is the blood thinners which are prescribed regularly his blood pressure cholesterol must be under control diabetes must be under control weight should be reduced so this is both applicable for primary as well as secondary prevention of a stroke there are other risk factors like uh, like smoking and alcohol which you should stay away from because they tend to uh, cause more uh, cholesterol levels in the body as well as the stiffening of the arteries and it promotes more blockages in the blood vessels so a good healthy lifestyle uh, rich in fruits vegetables salads less of carbohydrates normal protein intake and some yoga meditation to reduce the stress levels because everyone is predisposed to a huge amount of stress and uh, to monitor your blood pressure diabetes cholesterol and regular physician checkups or neurology checkups are very important so as to control these parameters and prevent yourself from getting a massive stroke so we at kokila bain dhirubhai ammani hospital have a dedicated stroke team so myself uh, who is uh, in charge of the stroke services we have around the clock uh, uh, emergency services available any stroke any point of time can be attended there is a round the clock ct scan and mr angio facility available we have a dedicated neuro interventionist icu setup stroke unit and a good stroke rehab so uh, even we have the latest devices for the mechanical thrombectomy or clot removal from the brain uh, the, the newer techniques that needs to be followed 
So all these taken together, we have a comprehensive stroke service, which can definitely help all the patients to, to treat stroke at the fastest and, uh, and live a very healthy life. Those who are at risk of getting a stroke definitely try to follow all these uh, instructions and, and prevent a stroke. That is more important as prevention is always better than cure.